Dom Link, it's your boy Ink. Welcome to the welcome to the show. I'm good to all because I'm having a wonderful day. I can see in the background we're playing the Ark Knight, my favorite fucking game. I love this game right now. Sorry if I swear. I swear a bit. Um, you can see this. I'm legally al allowed to, to swear. Um, we're going to be eating rice. This mukbang is the importance of rice. Um, so, just before we start, disclaimer, playing Art Knight, listening to Film Insights, I'm having a little party over here. It is 1.18 a.m. We just finished working. This is my last video of the night, so this is feeling fucking good. We've got KFC gravy. Then I'm going to add a little bit of taste to the rice. I love gravy and rice. Um, I love it, even though it is quite new to me. My Filipino friend taught me that. And do, then they're gonna do adobo rice and they're gonna do Jollibee gravy. And it is oh, fucking amazing. Um, so yes, we're having a mukbang on rice. I know what you're saying. Bro, you're having some weird mukbang. Yesterday was about rain, today's about rice. What is going on? Well, this morning, actually, we made a video which was a love letter to uh, peanut butter, yeah. Which was a video inspired by the video that I made two months ago, which was a love letter to um, to cereal. Now what I realize is, mm, oh yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit too, um, yeah. It's, um, it's a bit too cold. We just did a bunch of videos, so that's why it's a bit cold. I'm going to put it in the microwave for about 45 seconds. I'm going to put the fake position. Everything. That's, a, that's the good thing with about a one and a half. It is small, but it's so nice. So today is 12th November 2024, if I didn't say it. Um, oops. Give me a sec. Uh, you're going to need to give me another second. Um, because we're recording too. We're recording. So basically this Here's you. Here's me and this here's this So guys, uh, welcome back to art night. Sorry about this. Let's take a we're gonna be upgrading the with Adele um, And I'm super excited. I'm super super excited then uh, I'm gonna have to power her up again now. We have to check if with Adele which is an operator here that that Art night one of the best game look at her Unbelievable she is gorgeous. Promote. Okay, we'll see. Looking phenomenal. Can you come up with something new, Doctor? <laughs> I have call seat. I could have had call seat that it shows read. Yeah, she's a baddie. Okay, so now what I need to do, I need to check out if, um, next attack, attack 16%, attack involved is slightly shortened, attack strike 3 enemy at once, overload, attack strike 4 times in a row, kill can be manually, manually deactivated. Okay. Uh, we'll check it out. Now, souvenir, what is souvenir? Souvenir, attack after an, after image to the main tar what? Attack attachment after image to the main target. After image have a 15% chance to explode when affected by Wizardel Aftershock. Dealing 120% ethical damage to all nearby enemy and sending them for 0.5 seconds. That is good, but you're that is really good, but you're you're not Oh my god. That's really good, but you're not giving me attack on the um flying enemy, which is not great. Uh so we're gonna have to put a shockwave stun. What is it? Uh, next attack cause two aftershock. Look at ice, okay. Um, so now I need to upgrade this shit. Uh, I need to upgrade our skills and I need to upgrade our level. So it's not a big deal, but still. Uh, we'll do this because I'll, I'll be streaming. So One. Nice. Let's see how much it gave me. We need to have a lot uh, today. So the boat. I am so sorry, guys. Uh, we're doing two videos at once. I could have stopped both video, but this is a part of the content creator. You don't get to always do what you want to do. Okay. So now what I need to do? I need to go back. I need to go here. I need to go here, and I need to do this. 120. Perfect. Uh, 
Perfect. My gravy is cooked. Not my gravy, sorry. My meal. And we're back. So, yeah. So, rice. Rice had a huge part in my life. And when I say huge part, you guys don't even understand. Um, I'm going to show you something. A rice I have my father. My father wasn't the best cook. Wasn't the best cook, but he tried. He really, really tried. And the fifth, um, chicken and rice. It's very simple, but it's it's something that was part of my my childhood growing up, you know. And rice was this super super simple stuff. See, what I love about rice, what I always liked about rice, right, was that you can basically put anything you want with it, and it's gonna work. You can put um, vegetable. A bit too loud, huh? A bit too loud. Yes. So yeah, it's fucking delicious, and basically. It's very variable. A lot of countries are rent on rice, and I'm not trying to be funny, but even my friends from Philippines, life is rice is life, and they would eat rice a lot. And people, my job would make fun of them. My job was European, so rice didn't have this prominent part and the um, culture of Europe. Mmm, mmm, wow, amazing. The um, Mm. The gravy really has even right now in the background. I'm listening to Film Insight. I don't know if I told you, Film Insight. Film Insight is <laughs> Film Insight, and I thought it got. Oh wait, wait a second. You know what? Give me a sec. Oh, I I don't have to swear to God. I I I have the perfect opportunity here. Okay, so we'll do this. Give me a sec. I'm gonna listen. Why there's no sound? Cooking competition, you should know that it takes more than just skill to impress the judges. Dude, wow. Sue, a food blogger from Houston, nice. was featured in I season think, 11. Think. But here's the thing, Sue wasn't just a regular blogger. She was a passionate food lover with roots in Burma, a place where every meal tells a story of resilience and gratitude. Just like home. Uh, more true people. So when it was time to present her signature so dish, to she decided to present a tantalizing Burmese noodle soup with shrimp really was, and I'm coconut just curry as a tribute to her homeland. When Chef Sanchez and Joe walked in to check over her station, Joe was already all in for Sue's oh, dish. Oh my god. That was amazing. Well, I think we've already got ourselves our winner. We'll be like, and no, it didn't stop and start at the dish. It was the passion for a country that won our hearts. I come from a third world country. We have to eat so that we can survive. So we are already grateful to have a bowl of rice every day where I came from. Sue was brimming with determination to bring 